hat das. Ja, die fucking kidding me. Docking Bay, Docking Bay, Docking Bay. Binary Helix has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to perform studies with a long-range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. It all it took was one fucking solarium. That's all it took. One fucking solarium. It was the Solarian who was fucking, of course. He was he was having sex with another Solarian. No, with the Krogan, actually. And then they had babies, and they were just like, oh, here. And then it worked. And that's my story. Finally! I know. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. This ship is yours now. Damn straight he is. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Feel her well, Commander. I'll take good care of her, sir. I know you will, Commander. What kind of leads do we have? Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got us get scouring the traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Ferro system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact, and there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Ferros and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist, the conduit's the key to bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit? And we stop the Reapers from returning. I'll stop him. Cough, cough, Mass Factory. Cough, cough. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau Cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. Game straight, I your don't. actions Fuck still you. on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. That's your job, bitch! I'll, be careful. I'll try not to make things any harder on you, Ambassador. Glad to hear yeah, it, to full Remember, again, you God damn it. long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting to get to, Captain you were a human Anderson long before you. I'm still a human, God damn it. No, I changed my fucking species to a Spectre. God damn it. It's my baby. That is way too small to be the Normandy. I, I can't walk around in that thing. And there's like three or four floors to the Normandy and somehow that's the size of it? No. There's no way. But that is the Normandy size. The Normandy has to be huge. There's no fucking way that that is the Normandy. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. <clears throat> That's my big what happened to Captain Anderson. Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. Things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Saren's out there somewhere. I'm gonna find him. And we're gonna find him. I'm gonna punch him in the dick. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. That's right there. Air comes open. If you got anything you want to say to the crew, now's the time. This is Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Now it's time for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. Time to show them what humans are made of. <laughs> this began with an attack on a human settlement in the Traverse. But we know Saren won't stop there. His Geth armies aren't going to stay on the far fringes of Citadel space. Humanity needs to do this. 
not just for our own sake, but for the sake Rex. of every other species Rex. in Citadel space. Thank you, Saren must be I, stopped. Ashley. And I promise okay. you all, we will stop it. Oh, damn it, she's not hot in this game. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. The Captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Yes, Is sir. This the end of the game? What the fuck? Hurry, 14 part series. Yes. Let's go talk to Ashley. Ash. Oh, that's not the elevator like it was in the other games. Stacy. The SR2 is so much easier to move around in. Oh, there's an LVM. It's in here. Somebody's home, apparently. Huh. Nothing. Oh, now they're vacuuming. Okay, thank you for vacuuming. Oh, I don't want to talk to Kaden. I'm running so fucking fast. There's nothing down here. I should probably not be here. Sleeper. I did not do anything. It's like, give me some EXP. Oh, EXP. Let's go on and eat it. Got to shut once. You're gonna die eventually. Okay, nothing in here either. Where the fuck is it, buddy? Why is somebody still vacuuming? I really hope you cannot hear dad. Why am I talking like this? You do. Spectres make their own rules. You're free to handle things your own way. Second. See, Sec, you're very <clears throat> The damn bureaucrats are always on your back. For the most part, the rules are there for a reason. Maybe. But sometimes it feels like the rules are only there to stop me from doing my work. If I'm trying to take down a suspect, it shouldn't matter how I do it, as long as I do it. But CSEC wants it done their way. Protocol and procedure come first. That's why I left. So you just quit because you didn't like the way they do things? There's more to it than that. It didn't start out bad, but as I rose in ranks, I got saddled with more and more red tape. C-6 handling of 